Hey y'all, welcome to the channel. Welcome back if you're a new subscriber. Like, subscribe, check out jesse.coffee, get t-shirts while they last. There's a, there, there's seasonal things. Check out this welcome from President Trump. I'm gonna say something about this, but just, just watch this. He's at a rally. So I, I have to hit like my green watch. Look at that. It makes it. I'm not trying to be disrespectful. I'm doing a commentary. So I have to talk while this is playing. Look at this welcome here. If I, I can get down there, Senator McConnell. And this is Mitch McConnell. He's kind of the leader of the Republicans in the Senate. That's a big welcome. That's a big welcome from that audience. Remember all this fear Republicans had of Trump and now all of a sudden? Okay, this is a really, really happy crowd. Okay, see, see, he's saying he's going to agree with, okay, he's going to agree with, uh, with work with Trump. Okay. Now I'll put a link to this uh, video. Um, here's, here's the deal with this. I've, I've said it before. Other people have been saying it. I did not invent the idea, but I have been pounding this idea with my own flavor. When Republicans act like Republicans, when Republicans act like Republicans, they're powerful among Republican voters. So one of the things that people have been irritated with, the, the people that are you know, formerly Democrats now getting into walk away from whatever direction that they, they, they've come from to get there, they've been generally irritated, not with real Republicans, but with fake Republicans. It's the real Republicans that, that people like. Now, there's a lot more I could say about, you know, oh, I got my next appointment coming. There's a lot I could say about, um, you know, the future and where we're going and, and what's happening with the party and so forth. The, the thing is, much of the irritation from both conservative voters and with, with Democrat voters who don't like Republican politicians, they've been fake Republicans. Now, how did that happen? Here's, here's what goes on. First of all, you get a politician without a conscience or a politician who's, he's got some ideas, but he quickly loses his, he loses himself because he's not firmly grounded. He hasn't really taken time to understand the wolves den that Washington is. So they go in there, either they don't have a conscience or they slowly lose their conscience as they get surrounded in this, you know, Washington seems big when you're inside of it, but it actually isn't very big. So they, they get in there and they get surrounded by these consultants. And these consultants, they don't, they're not politicians themselves. They don't, they don't campaign. They don't, they don't get elected. They just study elections. And in, in their little theory world, they say, you have to get the independent voters. And, and independent voters are people who pride themselves on not having an opinion. They pride themselves on being indecisive. Th their opinion about politics is, I <clears throat> don't know. And it's, it's like that's independent voters really think that they're intellectual for not knowing how to draw conclusions. You know, it, it, it's somehow they've got that worked out in their thinking. And the, the political consultants come along and they say, you've got to get these independent voters in order to win the election. So don't sound like a Republican, sound like you don't know, and then the independents will vote for you. And and, and we're, people have been saying for years, Rush has been saying for years, I'm saying this, I've been saying it uh, for years, not as long as Rush has. No, it's not true. When Republicans act like Republicans, that's when Republican voters support them. And that's when the Democrat voters don't support them. Just look, look at what's happening with this walkaway thing. We got a lot of people 
that, that are stepping away from the old Democrat party, walking away and going toward conservatives. If you're a walk away, if, if you're one of the walk away people, you grew up as a conservative, you're raised a conservative, and then you went liberal because of college, and then you can't, you're now coming back to conservatism. Look at that. It all happened while Republicans weren't being Republican, and then people are joining walk away while Republicans are acting like Republicans. So, there's a political lesson in this. We should act like ourselves. And, and if we're the right guys, then we'll win. But there's also a lesson for this personally. Be yourself. Be yourself. Act like yourself. Be yourself. Act like who you are. And your life will be better. And if you've got a problem, you'll find it and you'll get it solved. But we need to all just be ourselves. That's really the, the takeaway from all this.